Hey, what's up, guys? Ankit this side from Let'sViewEffects.com, and uh, today we are going to learn the new effect which you have seen in my new video for Adil Khan. Okay, let me show you what we are going to learn today. So, okay, I hope you all watch this new edit. So. This, this is, is the effect which we are going to recreate right now. This is Black Panther effect. <laughs> I call it Black Panther. This is Okay. So let's get into Adobe After Effects and Premiere Pro. So here it is. This is Premiere Pro and let's make a new sequence 1920 by 1080p okay let me drag and drop my file right here and uh, yes this one is the raw file okay keep existing settings okay so this is our main file which we are going to work okay now what we will going to do first just right click on the video <coughs> and replace it with the after effects composition using dynamic link server and save the project over tutorials con karma name it con karma tutorial save okay so here we are in Adobe After Effects. Let's Control and D duplicate the original file and log the source file. Now we are going to work on the duplicate one. So let me tell you how to do this one. Let's go frame by frame. Okay. From here we will go to start. Split the layer control shift D and uh, here we will go to two. split again. Okay, and what we are going to do first, we have to do the basic rotoscoping for the characters just double click on the layer and we are in the layer panel so i'm going to use the roto brush tool for rotoscoping these two characters take this tool and uh, let me full screen the video okay and let's draw a garbage mask around our character wait a moment wait a moment Okay, so you have to check the frame rate also. Like, uh, if your video is on 25 frames, then you need your composition to be on 25 frames also. Click OK. Let's open it now, it will work fine. Cool. Let's draw a mask around this. okay so do it as much as correct you can do like the best roto can result the best effect actually so you have to take care on this rotoscopy right here okay this area is missing this one it's quite time taking process but you have to be patient for the effects because each and every good effect takes time so be patient okay so this is like a rough rotoscoping 
let's go to the next frame control plus arrow key okay here it is missing let's make it clear wherever you see okay here using alt you can like uh, remove the extra mask like which one is going out and uh, <coughs> without control you can add the mask let's go forward okay so his hand is moving right here do this remove this this one this one remove okay it's good to go let's go more do this do this 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 one remove add this one remove this one add this here <coughs> sorry go forward and it's add okay go 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 add right so it depends on completely rotoscoping like how better you can do so i'm doing it like a rough masking so don't mind but whenever you are going to make it as your own you should take care of rotoscoping in that video so that you can get better results okay So I think this is enough for a tutorial like you'll get an idea how you can create it okay so let's go to the composition split the layer and here's the main thing like how you can do now so minimize this one and be in the composition panel so we are going to put multiple effects to get the exact look which we have seen in the video so this is what we are going to make this one so for this look we need uh, like two to three effects on the same layer so that we can get this one so let's go how we can create it so rotoscoping is the first effect then after go to effects panel stylize cartoon this effect effects we have to put so this is basically a cartoon effect to get a change uh, video mood to the cartoonish so there's three option right here in the render option fill and edges edges and fill so we're going to stick to the edges and we are getting this result right here then after let's put one more effects go to channel and invert it so this is kind of new effect after that we need to add another effect go to color correction and hue and saturation just click on this colorize checkbox and increase the saturation lightness not too much uh, something like this change the color okay so saturation is full now and like if you need that red okay this is the red one see now it's clear so after this one we need to add one another effect called glow this one so that it boosts and uh, something and change the color to or red this one also red and in the glow colors instead of original use a and b colors and <coughs> increase the intensity 
and here we go see there is the result slip this is how you can create the effect and in view and saturation let's change this something yes so this is what we are waiting for this is how you can create this effect using rotoscopy and multiple other effects so this is basically a rough mask so you see right here like knees bench is uh, visible so that's just because of the rotoscopy so you need to take care of that and here is t-shirt just make it as clear as you can because the best roto can result the best output actually so this is the basic uh, tutorial about how i created this new effect in the adobe after effects so let's wait for another one and till that enjoy this one thank you for watching till the next tutorial please subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon and share it as much as you can so that other people also can make the same thing thank you